Hi, I'm Max from Ludovox, and today I am going to give you an overview of Bubbly Pop. Bubbly Pop is, is kind of an installment in the Match 3 genre for 1 to 2 players ages 8 and up, and it plays in 20 to 30 minutes. So in Bubbly Pop, what we try to do is to pop these little cute bubblies here. So they live in the sky and we make them fall on our planets because you play against the opponent's planets. And when you match three, either horizontally or vertically, you get to pop them and to put them in your scoring area. And the one with the most bubblies at the end of the game wins. So the way the game plays is very simple. But we have some strategy involved. We are going to interact with the other player in a really deep way. So first we look uh, at the sky and we, if we have empty bubbles, we have to fill them with bubblies. So we are going to draw from the bag Take one bubbly, it's a green bubbly. We have to place it to choose where to place it. Then a second bubbly, oh, it's a red bubbly, we're going to place it as well. So um, then what we're going to do is that we're going to swap two bubblies, either vertically or we could do it horizontally. So for example, this could be good for this player because he can um, have kind of a horizontal line. But there's a black bubbly here, so Eh, this might get in the way. Then the, the active player would choose two bubblies that are adjacent either horizontally or vertically and make them fall on his planet. And this is where the black bubblies come in. The black bubblies are basically rocks that, blocks your, that block your way. And uh, they get in your way, they're not very useful, and they don't match if you have three of them. So you might get rid of them by sending them to your opponent's planet with popping certain bubblies that give you uh, bonuses depending on their color or you can also uh, get rid of them with the yellow bubblies that help you remove uh, bubblies from your planet and score them. So you have a few ways of coping with them. Let me give you a quick recap about the, the, the powers of the bubblies that you pop. If you pop a red, you, you can swap two bubblies, two adjacent bubblies, of your opponent. So, for example, if he's like, let's say this, you can just break his chain and groove by doing this. Uh, green will allow you to do the same in your area. With um, purple, you can move one of your bubblies from your planet, a bubbly that is not covered, to the opponent's planet. So for example, I could uh, send my black here. Or with yellow, you could remove one of, of your bubblies that is not covered. So you could just score this and get a black out of your way. So this is basically how the powers uh, go. They help you cope with what you have or facilitate um, your play or would hinder the opponent. So the game ends when the bag is empty and that you cannot feel uh, fill the sky with more bubblies and the game can end another way if there is no legal move for you because well your sky and your planet is blocked well you lose the game because you've not managed very well so um, the solo mode is kind of the let's say puzzle and you try to pop the opponent's planet which, which is a scheme and you have 20 schemes that go from easy to very difficult well, you know almost everything about bubbly pops, so now bye bye, pop stars, and see you on the box.